anything I don't want you to think too much Let our bodies soak in the sun Yeah, there's no need to run, no rush You're my caffeine in the morning both and everybody watching at home so welcome to New York City today is a glorious day we are here to celebrate your love mm -hmm. yes? yes and so first thank you for having us be part of this such a special day mm -hmm. in your lives and thank you for choosing New York City mm -hmm. to take this big step I know <laughs> this city uh, has a, it's a very important place in your mm -hmm. hearts and this is how it all started Right? Yes. Like almost right. two years ago? Mm -hmm. Almost? Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes? Mm -hmm. Very good. So before we start, um, we're going to welcome God with us today. Mm -hmm. So I'm here to remind you that you have already been blessed. Mm -hmm. So today, God is a, big, um, is a big guest in your marriage because from today on, you start a new life. You start a new chapter with His blessing. Mm -hmm. So we're going to ask that He'll join us today. And once again, bless your relationship. Today, we're blessing your union. Mm -hmm. So from all of us here present and your folks at home, yes. um, we all want to tell you that we wish for you the absolute best mm -hmm. in this new life that you now undertake together. You have been to each other, best friends, companions. Mm -hmm. You have been all those things that embody this institution of matrimony, but Today you have decided to make it official, mm -hmm. to make it real. In a few minutes, you will be able to say, Andres is my husband, Stephanie is my wife, and your life will never be quite the same from today on. <laughs> yes? <laughs> Les yes. quiero dar la bienvenida a los que no hablen eh, inglés. Esperamos que esto lo vea tu familia en Colombia y yeah. todos tus amigos que hablan más o menos. Eh, que, nadie, que nadie se pierda, que nadie se quede afuera de este evento tan especial y tan trascendental en la vida de Andrés y de Stephanie. Ellos han decidido tener una unión muy íntima en el lugar en donde se conocieron y nos sentimos muy orgullosos, verdaderamente eh, muy honrados de hoy ser parte de este día tan especial y de asistir en la unión de estas almas tan bellas. Mm -hmm. I was saying that we feel very honored to be here to be part of your day mm -hmm. and to witness the natural progression of your relationship mm -hmm. as today you become husband and wife. Mm -hmm. And before we continue, I would like to bring to mind all the loved ones who couldn't be with us today, who are many, all those folks who stayed back home mm -hmm. and those who have uh, left this earth, even though they are absent physically, we know that they mm -hmm. are with us in spirit and they also help us bless your union. Quiero uh, pedir de traer a la mente a todos los seres queridos que hoy no pudieron acompañarnos, ya sea que porque están lejos o porque han dejado esta tierra, si bien están ausentes físicamente, están con nosotros en espíritu, nos acompañan y nos ayudan a bendecir esta unión. Marriage is a supreme sharing, perhaps the greatest and most challenging of adventures. It is the most challenging of human relationships and this you know because uh, you've been down this road before. Mm -hmm. You are experienced, you're mm -hmm. smart, you're mature. Um, it is also a joyous, uh, a joyful unity of a man and a woman whose care and affection and understanding for each other has flowered into a deep mm -hmm. love. And you are certainly an example of that. Mm -hmm. In this very town, in this town, a couple of years ago, God brought you together. Mm -hmm. You found each other. And um, we are very happy that you have chosen New York City to solidify your union. Your story is indeed a very, very, very special one. Your love for each other is so strong that endure the curves of life, life balls, the curve, curve balls yeah. that life mm -hmm. throw at you. Um, 
you are both each other's true best friends. You, um, you will continue to travel and adapt to each other, right? Uh, because you were in different cities when mm -hmm. you met, right? Right. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yes. So, yeah, so the traveling, the distance, the different cities n never presented a problem. Mm -hmm. That's how strong you are because your souls recognize each other. Because what brings you together is deeper and bigger than just the two of you or your personalities or your, you know, your everyday lives. Mm -hmm. You're really united by something that is invisible that you cannot explain. In such a marriage, the wedding ceremony is a gateway to, into this mystery and where you become one. The spiritual marriage is a real act of metamorph metamorphosis. Es un acto de metamorfosis, me sale mejor. A profound mystery of creation and rebirth where two become one. It is not giving up or lose of oneself, but rather giving over of oneself to something greater, a transformation of self, right, in which today, instead of saying I am, I am, no longer, it's not gonna be I am, I am, it's going to be also we are. So now from today on, maybe you started before today, this is why we're here today, but you start to think as a unit, as we, and not just me, 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 I want mm -hmm. this, I want that. Because your love for each other is so deep and so, pro so profound that you truly, genuinely care about the well-being of the person mm -hmm. who today is in front of you. So when you're making a decision, it's not just what's convenient to, for you, mm -hmm. but what's convenient for the whole is what really becomes the most important thing. Mm -hmm. So, delante de esta congregación, Afirman ustedes su deseo de entrar a este pacto matrimonial y de compartir todas las alegrías y las tristezas que esta nueva relación les depare. More, mostly for Andrés, ¿es así? Mm -hmm. que sí. sí, claro que sí. Muy bien. I was asking, do you come to this union on your own free will and with the intention to be mm -hmm. faithful to mm -hmm. each other in marriage? Mm -hmm. If yeah. so, say yes. yes. Yes, very good. Treat yourselves and each other with respect and remind yourself often of what brought you together. Mm -hmm. Give the highest priority to the kindness and the tenderness that your connection deserves. When difficulty or fear assails your relationship, remember to always focus on what is right mm -hmm. between you two, not just what seems wrong. In this way, you can ride out the storms when the clouds hide the face of the sun, mm -hmm. keeping in mind that even if you lose sight of it for a moment, the sun is still always there. Mm -hmm. And if each of you takes responsibility for the quality of your life together, it will be marked by abundance and delight. Mm -hmm. And now I would like to read um, a passage from Corinthians 13. Mm -hmm. It is a very popular one, and it is, uh, I think it's fitting because it talks about love. Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. Mm -hmm. And we all hope that that will be the truth for you, mm -hmm. that your hope, your love for each other will never fail you. Mm -hmm. And Stephanie, if I could yes, hold you. this one minute, because I would like for the two of you to hold hands together. Stephanie, your left hand with Andres' left hand. No, left oh, with left like and right <laughs> with right. Yes. So, like this? so right. So we make it this way. It's cross. Mm. So this forms an infinity symbol, mm. which symbolizes your love, which will go on forever. Mm. So as you hold your hands today, you also join your hearts mm. together. These are the hands of your best friend. Mm. They are holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together 
you build your future. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will hold you when fear or grief racks your mind. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it. May these hands always reach out with love, tenderness, and respect. May these hands continue to build a loving relationship that lasts a lifetime. And now with eyes locked and hands linked, this ritual is a beautiful symbol of the union of two hearts, two lives, <laughs> and two souls. In a moment, the two of you will exchange your wedding vows. No other human ties are more tender and loving, and no other vows are more sacred or important than the wedding vows you're about to exchange. En un momento, los novios intercambiarán sus votos matrimoniales. No hay promesa de amor más sagrada ni más íntima que la que se hacen hoy mutuamente el uno al otro. Nosotros tenemos el privilegio hoy de escucharlos a Andrés y a Stephanie recitar sus propios votos que han escrito con sus propias palabras. Pero antes de eso les voy a hacer las preguntas. So before, before you recite your own vows, I want to ask you the question. Andrés, knowing this woman love for you and returning it, realizing her strengths and learning from them, mm -hmm. recognizing her weaknesses and helping her to overcome them. Do you today officially take Stephanie to be your lovely wedded wife? I do 100%. <laughs> <laughs> okay. mm -hmm. And do you, Stephanie, knowing this man's love for you and returning it, realizing his strengths and learning mm -hmm. from them, recognizing his weaknesses and helping mm -hmm. him to overcome them. Do you today officially take Andres to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Very good. Mm -hmm. And now, mm -hmm. Andres, do you have special words for Stephanie? Yes. First of all, it is impossible for me to tell you how much I feel for you in this piece of paper, but I'm going to try it. Mm. Uh, Stephanie, I promise to make you the happiest woman in the world, to always love you, respect you, adore you, and be loyal to you for the rest of my life. I want to raise a beautiful family with you, with our values. I promise I will never leave your side, even in the worst moments, no matter what. I want to grow together and share our life experiences. I want my kids to have your eyes. <laughs> and your heart, because I know the purity of your soul. I want to create unforgettable memories together that we can tell to our grandsons. Mm -hmm. I want to educate our kids and family together with the best moral values. I want us to share our experience with them and make them the best human beings they can be. Mm -hmm. I want us together to teach them the value of things that are really important in life, in life, like honesty, respect, integrity, family, loyalty, and union. I want you to know that I'm entirely yours. And I want you to be entirely mine for the rest of our lives. And I want to finish this letting you know that you complete me and that my life is so much better and enjoyable when I'm near you. Stephanie, I love you forever. Yay. <laughs> Thank you. It is with a heart so full of joy today that I, Stephanie, take you on, Drace, to be my husband, my partner in life, and my one true love. Andres, I promise to you my deepest love and devotion as we take this next step in our journey together for the remainder of our lives. I vow to love you, respect you, to be faithful to you, and fully commit myself to you until the day that I die. 
I promise to have the patience that love demands and always have a heart that is ready to ask for forgiveness and forgive. I know that in you all of my prayers have been answered. I know us meeting was a gift from God and not something from our own orchestrating. I praise God for you and the love that he has given us together and the strong friendship that has been created between us. I promise to be here by your side as your partner forever and always from today until the last day of my life. I vow to cherish our marriage always and put our family above all else. I vow to help create a home full of laughter, learning, and most importantly, love. Andres, from this day forward, you shall not walk alone through the good, the bad, the sickness, and in health. I vow to always be by your side. As I give you my hand to hold today, I give you my life to keep. From this day forward, I will love you for as long as we both shall live. Yay! Thank <laughs> you. Yes, thank you. Father in heaven, give today your blessing upon the marriage of Stephanie and Andres. We thank you for the vows they have spoken and the love in which they are now united. Keep them faithful and strong in every trial. Sustain their joy and affection for many years. Equip them, Holy Spirit, with patience, endurance, courtesy, endless trust, and lasting love. Grant their home will be often a place of laughter. Amen. And now we have the rings. We'll ask that God bless these rings and the two who exchange them. Keep them in the circle of your love and protection. So these rings are very special, mm -hmm. the rings that you're about to exchange. They are physical and visible symbols that represent the inner commitment that you have just made to each other in your hearts. They are for everyone out there to know. Many people weren't here when mm -hmm. you took your vows, but when you're walking down the street, when you're going to work, when you're anywhere you are, people just have to look at your hand and they will know that someone special belongs to you mm -hmm. and that you belong to someone special. Mm -hmm. Just by looking at your hand and looking at this tiny little thing, they will know that you are loved. Mm -hmm. So wear them with pride and allow them to remind you often of how blessed you are mm -hmm. and how fortunate you are because you have each other. So when you're washing your hand, when you're looking at your hand, allow this little ring to remind you that someone decided to put their lives in your hands. Mm -hmm. And that is a big honor and mm -hmm. a big responsibility. And now, yes, um, Andres, if you wanted to just take it out and then take his. Wait, give me a minute. So a circle is a symbol of the sun and the earth and the universe. It is a symbol of holiness and perfection and peace. This circle symbolizes never-ending and everlasting love. It symbolizes your love and yourselves that wherever you will go, you will always return to one another mm -hmm. and to your togetherness. From today on, you become inseparable mm -hmm. and God is always mm -hmm. watching over you. Mm -hmm. I speak for all of us present here today and I'm sure your folks at home when I say it is our wish that as you wear these rings, your life together will be filled with love prosperity, health, mm -hmm. and a lot of happiness in everything that you guys start together. And now, Andres, I know you can't wait anymore. Yeah. <laughs> please, as you place the ring in your right <laughs> finger, please repeat after me. Stephanie, I offer you this ring. Stephanie, I offer you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And my loyalty. And my loyalty. With this ring. With this ring. I marry you. I marry you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Yeah. Very nice. And now, Stephanie, 
As you place the ring in his fingers, please repeat after me. Andres, I offer you this ring. Andres, I offer you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And loyalty. And loyalty. With this ring. With this ring. I marry you. I marry you. Yay! <laughs> okay, Stephanie and Andres, you have spoken the words and performed the rites which unite your lives. It is my legal right and greatest privilege to now officially pronounce you husband and wife. Yay. You may kiss your bride. Yay. Yay. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> you did it. Thank you. Sunrise, sunrise, sunrise